Hi boys and girls, welcome back. I'm Miss Ryan and I'm so excited to do some yoga with you this morning. So I have our schedule here. First, you can take off your socks and shoes if you haven't yet. Then we're going to do some different yoga poses. We're going to do yoga with rolling some dice and seeing which poses we get. And we're going to do some yoga with some different cards. And after that, we'll be all done and say goodbye. All right, so let's get started. If you have your shoes and socks off, go ahead and sit down, crisscross applesauce. And before we start our yoga, let's just take a big breath. Did you see how I lifted my shoulders up high when I took a breath in? You can try it like that too. And let's lift our arms up on this one too. Big breath in. And hands can come down to heart center. Remember in our yoga practice, hands at heart means namaste. It means thank you. Namaste for being here. Okay, yogis, let's start off with our yoga dice. Roll the first one for us. Here we go. Okay. Ooh, it's a challenge pose for our first one, but I know you guys can do it. Do you see it? One hand up, one hand down. All right, let's give it a try. So find your mat, put your hands down on the ground. Then you're gonna lift your legs up for a push-up position and one hand up to the side. Let's count to three, two, one, and switch. Can you switch hands? Other hand goes up for three, two, one. Come on down. Good work, guys. Okay, rolling our next dice. Here we go. Sitting up nice and tall with our feet and our legs straight. So find your mat, if you have one. You can always do it on the carpet too. Put your legs out straight, arms by the sides. Sit up nice and tall. Take a big yoga breath. One more like that. All right, let's see what's next. Here's our next dice. Ooh. You guys know this pose, right? It's tree pose. Okay, everybody stand up. Make your body as tall and sturdy like a tree. And then one foot stays down, one foot comes up. You can go a little higher with your leg if you feel comfortable. And you can even reach your arms up if you'd like. Don't worry if you lose your balance. Let's go ahead and switch feet. Take your other leg up. You could keep your hands down at heart, or again, maybe reach up. Good work, trees. Come on down. Okay, a few more times with our dice. Here we go. Oh, this one is bridge pose. So lay down on your back. Knees are bent. And as you lay back, then you take your belly up in the air. Let's count to three, two, one. Relax. All right, two more times with our dice. Here we go. Ooh, all right. Looks like this one is kind of a challenge, but I think you guys can do it. So we're standing up, one foot goes back. It's our dancer pose. Okay, everybody, stand up. Find your balance. Nice and tall and straight. 
And then this time we'll lift one leg back. Maybe you can reach back and grab it and stick your arm out. One, two, three, switch. Other leg goes back. Hold on to that foot if you can. Reach your other arm out for three, two, one. Relax. Nice work. Okay, last one for our dice. Oh, it's a peaceful, nice, relaxing pose for our last one. Crisscross applesauce and see that their hands are on their knees, like we're meditating. So find your crisscross position. Let's rest our hands on our knees. Take a couple nice, calm breaths. You can think about some things that make you happy, some things that you're thankful for. Maybe some of your favorite places. Anything that brings you joy. All right, good work with our dice. Let's go on to our cards. Okay, starting us off with a little bit of the challenge. So I think you guys can do it. Camel pose. So we go up on our knees. And to make this pose a little bit easier, you could just put hands on your back and look up in the air. That's a good stretch for the whole front of your body. If you feel comfortable here and you want to go further, you could reach back towards your feet. Let's take a big breath wherever you're at. And gently come on back up. All right. Good job. Next one that we'll do is happy baby, laying down on our back and grabbing our feet. Let's give it a try. Lay down on your back. Feet are up in the air. Hold on to them and you can act like a silly happy baby. And you can rock back and forth now and come on up to seated. more cards for us. Let's go ahead and do hmm, warrior three. Standing up, balance on one foot. Can you do it? And arms reach out in front. Three, two, one, switch, other foot down. Next leg reaches back, arms go out in front. Good work, warriors. Come on down. That wasn't too bad, right? All right, two more, and then we're gonna rest. We did this one at the beginning with the dice. Let's try it again. Our push-up position. Hands go down. Can you straighten your legs and lift one hand up? And switch, lift the other hand up, reach, reach. Come on back down. All right, guys, our very last one. Boat pose. We'll sit down. Put our arms up and then see if you can keep your feet up without falling backwards. If this is easy, you could try to straighten your legs in front. Take a big yoga breath. Good work, guys. Come on down to the ground and lay back. All the way back. You could get a big full body stretch. And then we'll take our final resting pose. So close your eyes. Let your body relax. Begin to wiggle your toes and wiggle your fingers. Bring a bit of a smile to your face. Feel good about the work you did in your yoga practice. And go ahead and roll to the side into a little ball. 
feel comfy and cozy and safe here. And go ahead and come on up to seated. And we'll close our yoga practice with hands at heart center and say, Namaste. Thank you guys for practicing. Big round of applause to you. Give yourself a big hug and a pat on the back. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.